Lake Powell, one of the nation's most important reservoirs, continues to face historic challenges as water levels remain critically low. According to the latest data released by the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation, the lake now sits at 3,548 feet above sea level, which amounts to just 30% of its total capacity. The reservoir is currently missing 152 feet from its full pool mark, and projections show that it is unlikely to recover to healthy levels in the near future. The shrinking of Lake Powell is the result of more than two decades of mega drought combined with persistent demand on the Colorado River system. As conditions worsen, concerns are mounting over the stability of the Glen Canyon Dam, which generates hydroelectric power for communities across the southwest. Experts warn that if water levels continue to fall, the turbines could soon become inoperable, raising the risk of Lake Powell reaching dead pool status, the point at which water can no longer flow through the dam by natural means. In anticipation of this possibility, federal engineers recently completed critical repairs to the dam's bypass lines. These massive tubes, which had rarely been used before, are now prepared to deliver water downstream should turbine operations cease. This safeguard is essential for maintaining the flow of water to major cities like Los Angeles and Phoenix, which rely heavily on the Colorado River for drinking water and other vital needs. While the repair work provides a short-term solution, the long-term outlook for Lake Powell remains uncertain. Federal officials and western states are under pressure to implement new agreements and stronger conservation measures as the southwest grapples with a drier climate and growing population. Without significant change, the future of both Lake Powell and downstream reservoirs like Lake Mead could remain in jeopardy, threatening water supplies, agriculture and power generation across the region.